All right, guys, we should be going live, or you should be able to hear me any second now. Hope you are all doing well on this lovely Wednesday here in Australia. For you guys, it might be Tuesday, I'm guessing, depending where you are around the world. Hopefully you can hear me all good. And we can get started on this full game walkthrough. Hopefully I can give you some tips and tricks along the way as well. And uh, we can just chill, have a good time. I know a lot of you are struggling with the game as well. So hopefully we can do something fun. All right. Let me know if the audio levels are all good and everything's looking good. Phallic Techno Pirate? Is that how you say it? Or am I wrong? I'm going to just call you C, but thank you for the love. I think that's Russian or something. I don't know. I'm terrible with names. This is Sifu, Uncle Larry. So um, I don't know if you guys have seen there's... My speed run is gaining a lot of traction online um, in terms of beating the game in 40 minutes. We're not going to do that here. We're going to play the full game, so it won't be 40 minutes. But, uh, yeah, just let me know how's the, how's the visuals and audio looking and if we're, if we're all good to go. I love the rain effect in this game. I love the art style. Matt Morgan, how you doing, man? We looking good? You guys let me know if we've got, a bit, we've got to figure things out. Funnily enough, this is the only time you can actually uh, hit a door open, which is weird. Oh, it's super fun, man. Trust me. Hopefully I can... Uh... Who are you? Who wants to go first? Hopefully, I can answer questions while playing because I haven't really done that. Yeah, I've done a couple of boss fights guides, but actually doing this at, at the same time. We need a weapon, man. Where's the weapons? Is there no weapons? Here's one. Here you going, PS5 hype? Now, we're playing as Yang at the moment, for those who don't know. It's a bit of the origin story prologue. You're getting stuck on level two? Look, I'm going to hope, hopefully help you out when we get to it. I thought you said they'd put up a fight. Speaking of level two, Sweat. this is him. This is Sean right here. Sweep the place. Nobody wins. Look at... Look at my stick compared to his. His has got some weighted edges. See that? I want that. That's like the Darth Maul lightsaber. You are the master of Kung Fu. I don't know about that, man. I do my best. What's What's weird is in this room here, there's nothing. Like, nothing that I've found. Like, so why can we go in this room? What are they trying to tell you here? There's two bedrooms Hmm. Nice little study. Where's his PS5? Where's the PC setup? Yeah, level two is a massive spike in difficulty. Look, I'm going to go through it in a minute and we're going to try and um, help you out, man. Don't worry. We'll do, our, do my best. I'm just going to try and explore this playthrough and, and just do everything because, um, you know, some of you guys don't know where certain collectibles are and things like that. So this should help with that as well. Great, uh, great soundtrack. I've uploaded the soundtrack. Get him now. Ready? You got to throw this. I mean, that's fantastic. Ready? Dodge the bottle. These goons are so easy in the prologue. It makes you feel like I'm going to be fine playing this game. This, this game's going to be a breeze. And then you're in for a rude awakening, aren't you?
What do we want to do? We've only got two options. Try and not take as much damage this time around. This game is so fun, man. I could not believe the reviews. Some of the reviews are 4 out of 10. Like, that's insane. Look at this. You feel like a badass, man. Look at, look at these guys. And what's cool is I think some of them, like, move. Hold on. Okay, maybe not these guys. I think I've killed these guys. When you're playing as a main character, you do... I believe... They... Where is he? This guy never talks. Have you noticed? Never talks. This is the um, level one boss right there. If you couldn't tell. Crazy eyes, I call them. Hey, Nathan, how you doing, man? Yeah, the game's fantastic. I know you're playing Dying Light 2, but man, this has pulled me away. Yeah. Of course. He is mute, so, yeah. Watch this, guys. Here's a really nice detail for, you, for those of you that... I'll tell you when. There's the five bosses. But I must. Come, get some. You want to do the fucking taunt, bro? You want to do the taunt? Let me do the taunt. Come at me. There's a little detail some of you might not know, eh? God, this sweep's good. If you want a t tip, use the sweep. Abuse, use and abuse. These guys are watching. This guy's always got a smoke in his hand. Always got a smoke. Oh, okay. We're here to play, are we? We're here to play, Mr. Miyagi. Oh, I love this movie, does. Watch this. Ready? He moves back and comes in with these swipes. That's a move you can unlock in the uh, in the skill tree. It's actually quite good for dodging and then coming back in. Works well. The sweep is a focus attack that you got to unlock. I highly recommend it. When I look into your eyes, I see nothing but a frightened, angry child. See how the rain drips off him, off his hair. You see that? Nice little detail you might have picked me. It's, and also, this is where the... Um, this is very similar to the final fight in the game, if you notice. It's raining. It's in the same sort of area for those who've, who've seen the ending. So it's really, really cool. Yeah, no problem, man, for the tips. Have you beaten the game? How many of you guys have beaten it at this point? I mean, it's only just come out, really. So I was, I was lucky enough to have a, re a review code for a couple of days there. So I've put in about 30 or so hours. Um, look at this one. I love that little kick he does. It's so nice. Yeah, I've platinumed the game once on PS4. I've done most of the achievements here on PC. And PS5, I'm a couple of trophies off. So technically, I've nearly platinumed it three times. Ready? Watch this detail here. Hold on a second. Yeah, nice, man. Use my guide if you want to help with Yang, but you should be fine beating him. And this is Yang for anyone that doesn't know. Show yourself. So who are we going? Boy or girl, guys? Boy or girl? Let me know in the chat. What do you want me to go for? I'm trying to beat it without exceeding age 25, Ricky. Good luck, brother. Good luck, man. Um, I believe in you. 
If you can get through the first two stages at 21 max, you're looking good. Boy, girl, boy, boy, we're going boy. Now, watch this really cool detail. Ready? Watch the bosses at the back. Watch the bosses at the back. Watch the bosses at the back as he kills. Watch. They turn their heads. They turn their heads. None of the bosses, except for Yang, the other three bosses turn their heads at the child being killed. Very interesting detail that a lot of people might not have picked up. I really like that. I only noticed it recently. But if you pause it there, if you slow it down, you'll see that those bosses um, actually move their heads away. Very cool detail. Oh, this is so sick. This has to be the sickest intro. Come on, guys. I mean... And you don't even know... Well, I didn't know because I'm an idiot. That you're actually facing off against the, the bosses and you're learning the techniques to, to beat them. Without even knowing it. Apparently I can't parry. But I can throw, apparently. Oh, they want me to... Yeah, right. This might be one of the best tutorials I've seen in a long, long while. I haven't actually tried this palm strike on this boss. I might have to try that. I might actually have to try that. Yeah, trophy guides, uh, John Kid. What trophies are you looking to, to do, man? I'll help you out here in this video. I pretty much know how to do them all. Um, the only iffy one is the takedowns. I still haven't worked out like I've done it, but I don't know which ones I got and which ones I missed, you know? Dan, you've actually got to sweep this girl? What the fuck are you doing? That's another move I don't do enough, the sweep. Man. Maybe I should be sweeping that bitch. Someone remind me. The leader. Sifu. made it it took me so long to work out what takedowns I was missing turns out it was the one you do while running yeah the one I just did eh all right let's get into mission one the squats 
What does Sifu mean? A quick Google search will help you out there, man. But essentially, it's like, I believe it's the um, master of like Kung Fu. Um, like a master, skillful person. Maybe not specifically in relation to Kung Fu or maybe martial arts or something, but it's like master or something like that. Yeah, master, Ricky says, yeah. They blocked the entrance to the warehouse. This game's phenomenal for anyone that that hasn't played it. I, I guarantee you should, um, you'll have a good time. Well, I can't guarantee it, but man, I had a good time with it. Oh, I love that takedown. Oh, oh, oh. Boy, oh boy. Now, there's two ways you can go up here if you want. You can climb up there. We're going to go through this way. Now, there is a shortcut through here that you can take. We don't have the key. So we need to obtain that key. So we won't be going through there at this stage. And we get the crowbar. Crowbat, I was about to say. Crowbar. And we just smash this guy. He doesn't stand a chance. And this guy wants to have a piece of me, apparently. Okay, mate. Good luck. These junkies don't wake up right here. I've tried throwing bottles at them. Junkies. I don't think they'll be a problem. No, they're not a problem. I think they're fucked up. There's one up here too sleeping. Don't know what he's up to. Any other little Easter eggs and secrets here? Uh, what, what's this? Someone with a baby? Okay. Some photos. Sometimes they put like dev photos. Stuff like that. I'm going to throw this next guy off the roof. Look what we have. Only a fool would come here. I've got to throw him off here. Will it let me? Let's find out. It's a bit wonky, but it can be done. Can be done. Man, use mockery. You also get more points. What do you mean? Oh, if you like, um, if you be a dickhead, is that what you're saying, Mr. Toast? I can make it. Just need to run it. I think that's what you mean, eh? Hey, how'd you get in here? No freaking way. This guy doesn't even get the bottle off. Whoa! Okay, mate. Nice way to introduce yourself. Another junkie in here. Okay, we got some collectible here. Purple mist. Here's a little Easter egg to old boy. Check this fucking clown out. Can help you with something? Leave these people alone. Oh, we got ourselves a real life white knight in here. Let's relieve him of the cop. Got a real white knight here. What? What? I don't have the sweep unlocked. Oh, I feel so vulnerable, man. Oh, that really hurt him a lot then. Just one at a time here. Quite simple. Heavy attacks are your best friend here with the crowbar. Should be fine. This guy's probably the biggest nuisance this one at the end, but really he's, he's a piece of piss. That's how you deal with those guys. 
How you going, Linksy? Good to see you, mate. We looking good on audio and quality, guys? Just let me know. Should be all good. Now, I want to try something here, guys, because you've got this room here. And you got this room here. I'm just not going to go for them. I'm just going to go straight out here and see if they end up coming. I don't remember if they do or not. If they get involved with this fight. Because if not, you're skipping... Yeah, look, here they are. So that's annoying now. That's just annoying. Look at them all funneling in. Oh, God. This is a weird angle. Shit. What can we do here? Is there any... There's no weapons or anything? I swear there was. There's nothing? Well, you can just use your environment here, guys, and sort of... See, look at this. You can always use your environment. Now, to, to make enemies drop weapons, square, square, triangle on PS4. Square, square, triangle, and he'll drop the weapon every time. It's the combo... Um, I'll show you a combo. This one here, push kick. That will make them drop their weapon every time. Right? Just a little tip for you. And never uh, do what I just did there. Never take down guys with that are enraged. Because then you'll be in big trouble. Like me. But a way to cheese him is just keep going over and over. Oh, he's going to go around. Are you joking? What? Is this guy glitching out? What the? Let him come over and then hit him. See that? It's a, it's a little move. And you can just keep going back and forth. Hit him as he comes over. This is what I mean. Use your environment to your advantage to beat these fights. If you can also unlock an ability to throw these little chairs around, which really helps as well. Currently, I've got nothing. It's a first playthrough. Room in the other room. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. You're right. What the hell? Look at these two. They've completely glitched out. Wow, that's interesting. That is a first. I'm not complaining. I'm not complaining, but that is very interesting. Man, you know your stuff. You know your stuff, Dark Prince. I'll give you that, brother. I'll give you that. So there you go. That was a little experiment. I'm getting closer. Um, obviously, you should take those guys out earlier. Don't do what I just did. Take them out when they're oblivious to you. That'll make that fight a lot easier. Hey, Riles, how you doing, mate? I've gotten Fajr down to Flawless Age 20, Sean Age 21... Kumakai, age 27, age 32, but unfortunately can't beat Yang until my 60s. you get better, man. Just keep pushing. I'll show you how to deal with Yang. You can also watch my boss fight video, but... Um, now, what am I going to go for in this playthrough? Hmm. Um, <laughs> I'm going to go for focus. I'm going to go for focus. You can actually push this girl off the edge, by the way. Let me try and do it for one of them. Hold on. Alright. Hold on. Let me try for you here. Is there something I can pick up? No, hold on. Hold on. Let's just try something here. Ready? And... Fall. <laughs> can you see it? I think you can see a dead body there. Just another jump here. Another jump here. Do you have tips for Yang, perhaps? Learn his patterns. He's got about six or seven sort of patterns that he goes through. Oh, this guy's such a piece of piss. When you work him out. Let me just see that again. Yeah, look, he didn't even touch me. 
I'm pretty sure you can just heavy, heavy, heavy those guys and they never touch you. Most of them. Um, there's the bills there. Again, we're going to be going through and collecting everything here for everyone that wants to see. Uh, this guy here is just a free, free hit. Now, I have called this a no-death run, so I have to live up to my name now. Hopefully we don't die. Because I haven't played all day, to be fair. So just you just want to isolate the room a little bit here, guys. This is probably one of the harder fights, technically, in this level. You just sort of want to isolate the room a little bit. So you don't want to do what I'm doing here, where you've got to... You've got to have all these guys on you at once. It's it's not ideal. Don't take down that guy. That would have been bad news. Yeah. Also, if you want a trophy, just do this over and over. 30 times you get a trophy. This guy's a bit of a nuisance, eh? Whoa, I've never seen that animation before. Wow. That's cool. Now watch this cheese. Ready? Hold on, we need a weapon. Is there a weapon around here? Can't remember. Hold on. Yes, there is one right here. Ready? Watch this. Hit him. Oh, I've stuffed that up. Wait, ready? As he jumps, hit him. Three heavies, jump over. Wait for him to jump back. Ready? Three heavies. One, two, three. Jump back over. So just a cheese way of dealing with them. One, two, three. Jump right over. He's just he's just gone through the wall. He's just gone through the wall. That's a bit rude, mate. Jesus Christ. And that's how you deal with him. That was a bit scary. He came through the wall and I wasn't ready. Uh, how do you know what guys not to take down? You can tell they've got this little glow to them. They've got this little smoke coming off them. Exactly, Matt. Um, exactly, Havoc. Exactly right. I need help with the club for sure. Well, we're nearly there, so hang on. Now, these two in here, it's annoying. See these two in here? There's one there, one on the right. Now, you want to focus on one straight away. Ready? Watch this. Focus on this guy. Bang, bang, bang. Ah, I knew this guy would get me. Eye strike. Finish him. You want to make that a 1v1 as quick as possible. Otherwise, this can get out of hand, this fight. Why did I... Where's the bottle? Oh, my God. And now we got to be careful here because I'm very low on health. Should we just do... <laughs> and there's the first death. <laughs> oh, shit. Well, we lasted, what, 10 minutes? <laughs> That's what you get for fucking around, eh? Uh, ideally, you want to pick up the bottles here and take him out. He's, he's not really a nuisance. I'm just being an idiot. Look, he's pretty easy to deal with. He does the same moves over and over, so... Um, Alright, so we've got another focus here I'm going to pick up, and then we're going to leave the focuses for a bit. That key's there. Those keys there... Are to take the shortcut earlier on. So we don't have to deal with any of this crap. That square-square triangle weapon drop combo is going to be great. Thanks. Oh no, my pleasure. Very, very useful. For when you want them to drop, um, you know, when you want them to drop that weapon. You challenged me to get the good ending. Okay. I'll do it just for you. Now, the tip here, guys, is simple. You need to take out these guys first. So there's one over here, right? You want one here. 
This is going to make the fight so much easier. Pick up the, the weapon here on the ground. Then come all the way back. And take this final one out. You've just eliminated three with no with ease. Do you know how much that helps this fight? Do you know how much this helps this fight? And then you come down here. And you take this one out in two shots as well. See that? So you've taken four enemies out that quickly. You know how much that helps this fight? Now, where's the guy with smoke? Got to be careful. I like to just be careful and not... See the guy with smoke? You see that, guys? See that guy with smoke on his head? That's the one you don't want to take down because he will go in raged form. You see that now? Hopefully you see that, guys. And, well, that theory doesn't work. Because that guy just did it on me. That's weird. Okay, well, you learn something new every day, don't you? Alright, I've got to be careful here. Just use your environment. This isn't a speed run, so there's no need to rush. There's, a, there's usually a crowbar here, but he's taken it off me. The bastard. Okay, we just got to try and isolate these guys. Here we go, there's a weapon. This guy's a real nuisance here, so let's just try and get this woman. Yep. That helps, so now we're down to two. Just sort of attack, weave out. I'm trying to play this a bit like one of you guys, you know? If that makes any sense. He nearly un he unblocked me. Oh, wow. Wow. Okay. Very interesting. I'm using this to learn a few things myself as well, guys, just so you know. Alright, let's just finish this guy off, eh? Wolf Bandits with a 29. Thank you, man. I appreciate that. I don't know if you left a message. Let me just check this. No, you didn't leave a message, but I appreciate the, the dono, man. Thank you so much. Um, even though it is, uh, it is only a dollar Australian, it all helps, man. Thanks. All right, so there's a purple flower here that you pick up. I'm glad I'm not the only one who uses the jump over cheese. Exactly. you got to use the cheeses. Got to use the cheeses, man. Now, watch a cheese here. I'll show you. So when you come through this door, watch this for a cheese. You're thinking, oh, this is actually a tough battle here. we got these, these three guys. I'm low on health. What do I do? Watch this. Bang. One shot. He's dead. pretty easy really and then I took a hit because I'm shit and that is pretty much all the goons for this level as we head into the final boss man this segment could be shortened it was necessary to destroy the girl who was the passage to stairs that's you could have about four left Oh, okay, maybe you're right, yeah. Maybe you can be short, and I'll have to go back and, and look at that, man. Um, increase weapon durability. Yeah, I might as well. Door before the boss fight. So, let me tell you about that in a second. You're talking about this... This door here, so hold on. This is the key card right here. That, that key card unlocks the room to the sanctuary, by the way. Now, this door here, you unlock this in another level. And that, you unlock that room with the key in the 
fire chest in level two, I believe. Yeah, we'll go through this, guys. I'll, I'll let you know. Alright, guys. This boss is quite easy. Uh, you literally just gotta avoid... Weave, avoid, and use the weapon to your advantage here. So you just can't... He comes in hot every time. And you just go heavy... You can play a bit aggressive on this guy, I've found. I mean, I don't have many abilities to, to run off, but... Look. Look, he's just... He's not that good. He really isn't. He's just a little bit predictable. And then he has that one little fucking low that gets me every time. Everything else, I'm fine. It's just that low. If I ever go for a no damage playthrough, it's going to be the low that fucks me in this fight. Everything else, look. Got him down pat, really. And that's it for this one. Do you want me to spare or kill, guys? Do you want me to go for the good ending? Spare him? <laughs> Face reveal. If you want a face reveal, go to my other a thousand interviews and live streams. <laughs> or look at my actual profile picture. Now, nah, how you going, Vincent? It's good to see you, man. You think the key's in the last level, right? Okay, this, this part's even easier, in my opinion. Weave. Bang, 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 bang. Now, I'm going to go get a weapon. There's weapons lying everywhere around here. Now, I just I just want to quickly test something for you guys. We'll go for the good ending, yeah. We'll just test something here, guys. Whoa! Okay, mate. Shit. If I just keep running, will he end up hiding in the bushes? Or will he just keep waiting for me? I think he'll just slowly crawl to me the whole time. Yeah, he will. All right. I just got to parry a few things here because I got to get the structure up if I want to get the good ending. Whoa, man. got to be careful if I want to spare him. Alright, so what I'm trying to do here, guys, is get his structure up. If that makes any sense. See the bar on the top there? See how it's slowly going up by me parrying? You see that? I'm just waiting to press L1 right at the last second. I'm not hitting them all. But um, his, his parry's going... His structure's going right up by me doing this. Oh, now I've got low structure. Bottom right, see how I'm red? I'm breakable now. One more shot through my um, blocking and he'll be able to punish me. So now i just got to step away from the fight. Recharge. Recharge a little bit. Okay. Hope I'm showing you how to block here. It's that final kick. I, I think you have to weave the final kick. By the looks of it. Yeah. As I said, guys, I'm learning things with you on this flight, in this uh, playthrough. The objective of this playthrough is just to get 100%, you know, go through the trophies, go through the... Detective board. All that sort of stuff. Give you guys some tips along the way on the boss fights. Alright, he's nearly there now. Yeah, I gotta I gotta block that last one. I gotta weave that last one. Alright, he's getting close now. Nearly there.
Come on, bro. You're so breakable right now. Oh my god, really? There we go. Now, to spare them, don't kill him here. Don't kill him there if you want to spare him. Now... Oh, I didn't know he comes out of there. <laughs> Shit! What the hell? How does he come out of there? He's never gone there. What the fuck? <laughs> Are you serious? This dude's throwing out all the stops, man. All right. Where is he? Oh, hurry up, bro. We don't have all day, man. So you just want to get his structure up. Uh, come on, mate. There's a parry. Strict timing on that. Tell you what. Let me just try and parry this one. Yeah, it works. Well, the block works. Oh, my God. Nearly there, guys. No! Oh, I thought I killed him by accident. Yeah, I've never seen that tech writer. So there we go. We spared him. We spared his life, even though he killed us all those years ago. When I said it was easy, I know. I know, right? I legit haven't died to that boss in so many playthroughs. It's so funny. It's what happens when you're stuffing around, though. But it's all fun. Now we head into the club, which uh, a lot of you are struggling with. This is weird, because I've already got these achievements, but they're popping again? What's the what was that achievement for? Does anyone know? Someone might have to look that up for me. What that achievement does. All right, let's get some upgrades in. I'm not going to perma unlock anything. So, we're going to get the sweep, my favorite, as you guys know or some of you know. We're going to grab the weapon catch. We're going to grab ground counter, environmental master. We're going to grab the Chasing Strikes. And we're going to grab the Pushback Cancel. Okay. How to avoid hit when some enemies with weapons hit and screen goes black for a bit. What do you mean, man? I'm stuck at the boss at the museum and I watch your video. I still can't beat. There's a cheese way to do it, zombie, that I've figured out that I will upload that video today or tomorrow. There is a cheese way to get through that fight. That's a, a viewer has, has found. Um, and I might try it. I actually might try it in this playthrough. Whoa, what the... See, I love the, the reflections off the ground here. Come back tomorrow. This guy's an asshole, isn't he? He's a real asshole. He's just a real pain in my ass. Yeah, how about you come to me, mate? How does that sound? Come on, come on, dickhead. Uh, the PS5, it does on PS5 version. This is a PC version playing on the PS5. What do you want? Sean, where can I find him? Guys, we got a problem here. Live action trailer. Do you mean the live action, um... Do you mean the live action short film? Is that what you're talking about, man? Because the, the short film, sick. Love the short film for Seafood that they put out. Put 
See, that's a that's a move you don't want to get hit by. That one right there. So, can you go into more detail on how you get the spare ending? Yeah, so you just have to... Like you just saw then, you've got to spare every single boss. And then spare Yang at the end. And it's actually quite tough to spare all the enemies. And no, not die in the entire... Uh, run through. Actually, really tough. Be careful here. I think I can get him. Yeah. I just want to be careful. I don't want to enrage anyone. I literally hate the enragers. They're literally my worst enemy type to face over all bosses and shit. I don't know about you guys, like, they're just annoying. Once again, use your environment here, guys. Take this club owner. I call this guy the club owner. Take him out. He's annoying. And then these two don't want to come in for some reason. Here's a little thing you can do as well. Come over here. And you can actually make this guy fall off. Well, I sort of did it. I mean, you can push them off balconies and stuff like that. Does anyone struggle with this girl? If you do... I was going to say grab a bottle, but I don't have one. Hold on. There's one there. Ready? Just sort of um, use the environment on her to get the upper hand. So watch this. Ready? See that? It's pretty cheap, to be honest. Like, this is really cheap stuff, but I know that's what you guys want. We're not here to muck around. As the Aussies would say, we're not here to fuck spiders. Look, this is really... And this is just for the environmental master. I mean, look how cheap that is. And that's just one easy way to take out some of these enemies. I'm just, I'm just trying to show you the variations here. Because a lot of people don't know. That skill, to do what I was just doing then, that skill is called environmental mastery. Okay. Okay, we've got a little, uh, a little thing down here. Now we want to get this one for the boss, upcoming boss. You got to be careful here because I think this guy can be enraged. Pretty sure this guy can be enraged and he doesn't have smoke. So, look, see? See that? Yeah, see? Not good. Let's see if I can throw him. I'm interested to see if I can throw this guy. Nah, I don't think I can. Let me try something else here. What else have we got to work with? Anything? I think we've used everything. I oh, know there is a bottle over here. I like to use everything the environment has to offer. See? That's why I love this club area, because you've got a lot to work with. Then we come in here, we take this chick out, one shot. Easy done. Then we... you got to be careful here because there's a few of them. What I like to do is actually work my way around to this guy. Get rid of him, use the stool. See that? Look at this environmental work I'm doing here. Just to clear them all out, it just really helps. Look, she's helping me. I mean, you just threw one at your friend, mate. What are you doing? Again, pick up a bottle. Always move to the next area with some sort of environmental. I wonder if I can hit him from here. Let's have a look. Yeah, that didn't work. Is there another bottle? No. You just run into things. I love the physics. I love the physics. There's a bottle. 
Now watch this. Straight for this one. Finish this one. Look at that. You've just taken two out. Grab the bottle. Bang. Push this guy over here. Now watch this. Off the edge. <laughs> That's how you deal with that area. Beautiful. Okay, moving on. Moving on. These little farts here. These guys are easy. This chick's take her out quickly. Don't... Look, I tried to take him off the edge here last time, but it didn't work. So... Uh, I'm not sure you can do it, to be fair. Throwing him off that edge there. I mean, uh, do you want me to try again? I'll try again. Let's have a look. Oh, there you go. Easy. Uh, for some reason, last time it didn't work. How do you handle... How did you grab throw? Uh, X and square. X and square. Yeah, there's multiple takedowns. Correct. Okay. Because we've got <clears throat> environmental mastery on, look at all this stuff lighting up to take out these guys. These two aren't a problem, right? The only reason they're a problem is because there's two of them. It's just annoying. So what you do is you come over here and you get taken down by this guy. That's the first step. No, you definitely don't do that. See how you can push him over? I just find that very helpful. Let me just gain a bit of health here. Okay, we're going to push this guy over so I can focus on this one. Got to, just got to get the timing right on that. Now I can kill this guy here, so I'm going to do that. Bang, and I'm going to sweep this next guy. Ready? Sweep. And now watch this. If I do heavy, 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 heavy block. Great block, you fucking idiot. Anyway, you can afford to be grabbed. I just got grabbed twice and barely lost any health. So really, it's not too much of a worry. You don't have to be flawless through there. Okay, moving on. It's closed for tonight. I don't think so, honey. It's never closed. Always throw that on her because you want to take one out easily. It really helps this fight. Trust me, guys. That is the most deadly move. You see how much health I took then? These guys are really painful. These two. I, I actually still struggle a little bit with them. They're just annoying. Because the way they jump over is very annoying. So watch this. Just try to use that environment to your advantage. Again, look how good this weapon... Look how good that mastery is. You know, just you don't have to rely on blocking everything. Okay, in here, there's a trophy you can get. I'll tell you how to get the trophy right now. He's just fallen off. Okay, mate. I'm going to make this guy fall off as well. Hold on. What are you... What are you doing? Okay, there's a trophy here if you take out the big guy first. You get an achievement. Okay, see that big guy down there? Take him out first, you get the achievement. Um, I'm just seeing... Because I'm actually a bit low on health here. Got to be careful. All right, well, we're going to go in. He's low. He's low here. Yeah, see? It's just... When you're that low on health and you've, you're you trying to get the achievement as well, it becomes a bit difficult. That's why it's probably best to go for the achievements in another sort of run. Although I was one, one shot off there. See that pit protector it's called? I'm using this square square triangle just to give myself some distance from these guys. Oh god. 
I am not having luck with enraging these guys. This guy's like glitched out over here. Now see that? That's terrible angles and I still managed to evade because I've played this game so much I know I know what he's going to do. Oh, so funny. Literally could not see a thing then. The Volchi does clip through walls. Yeah, which moves you suggest we should permanently unlock? Sweep, number one. Environmental Mastery, number two. People love the ground counter as well. I don't use it that much, but people love it, so maybe that one. I'll never forget the demo of this I played. This guy, I thought, man, this guy's so tough. I thought, this guy's so tough. Now watch, watch how you deal with him now. He's literally a piece of piss. He's so easy. Ready? It's embarrassing. Look at that. He got a little bit off me. I'll give him that. He got a little, little bit of health off me. So... Ground count is useful against the second boss. Okay. Okay. I, I, I honestly haven't used ground count very often, so... Now, guys, here, I was making the mistake of fighting these guys. You do not have to fight these guys. I'm just stupid. So I'm investing in the middle section now for this, for this second boss. Pick up the crowbar as well here. And do not fight these guys. You can if you want. You can, you can cause a fight. But we're not going to do that. We're not going to do that. I'm ready for the trials. Then step through the door. Now I'll show you a little cheese way to get through the trials here if you want. Um, first up. Head straight to this right door. Ready? Head to this straight right door. Watch this. Ready? Bang. You get a free kill. Just like that. Really helps. Then you can take this chick on. Two quick kills already just like that. Just really helps. I've found. Now we're going to go kill this one. Finish what we started. Oh, I'm not going to be able to. i just got to be careful here. I'm going to sweep that one. Okay, we're going to sweep her. She's being annoying. Now what we're going to do, the little cheese for you, for you guys. If you're not confident with that, watch this. You've got bricks here you can throw for a start. You can just throw bricks all day, right? Or you can actually throw them off the edges here if you want to be really sneaky. So that didn't work there, but literally you just throw them off edges. You know what I mean? You can just sort of push them off here or push them off there. or And you've got these bricks to work with. You've got so many bricks. So many weapons, like, this should not be hard for you guys to get through once you put in a bit of time with the game. I barely ever die now in that, in that area. Okay. This bitch up here is annoying for some. Um, yeah, I did have a strategy for her. Throw the brick, get some damage off, pick up the staff, now what? Let me just see if this works. I don't know if this worked. We're just gonna, we're just gonna test things out here, guys, so I just want... Yeah, see, I just got a little bit of health off here, but it's not worth it. You might as well just dodge. Get a sweep. So once you get the sweep, you can get rid of the weapon. So she doesn't have the weapon. And then she becomes predictable in her movements. She does high, high, low, low. And then she also has that combo, which you got to watch out for. Now, what she just did then, the three... 
delayed sort of punches is what's going to happen up here in this next encounter. All right, so we got some collectibles here. Uh, not one there, hold on. One there. One there. Now, you can't get into this yet. That'll be the last thing we get in this level. This is on PC, yes, yeah, PC gameplay. Ready? Straight to this chick here. Now, I don't have focus meter, which is annoying. Oh, God. I'll stuff this up completely. She's got less health. So, ideally, you want to... I got a, got a lucky break there. Ideally, watch this. See if I can actually... Yeah, look at that damage I just got on her. You can actually push them off. That can help. Let's try it on this guy. As he comes up here, let's try and push him off. Ready? Look at that. There's a sneaky little move for you guys. To take these guys out. How's that? Let's try it over here. He's on the edge there. He's on the brink. Let's go back over. Let's go back over. Okay. He wants to be a pain. Okay, mate. You want to be a pain. Fair enough. Alright. Final boss time. Do you reckon this is more unforgiving than Sekiro? Yeah. You're probably right, man. Um, improve weapon damage and impact on opponent's structure. Yeah... I don't think we need that. Um, increase impact of parry on opponent's structure. Yes, we want that because we're going for sparing. If you're going to spare the bosses, that's what you want right there. All right, next skills to get. We're going to grab the vertical strikes. The crotch, pr crotch punch, <laughs> crotch punch, raining strikes, slide will be next, and then weapon mastery. All right, guys, here we go. Sean's sweep attack is more of a less more more or less way more predictable than normal enemies in my opinion. I think this first stage is really easy with him. I don't think that's an issue. It's the it's the last stage that people have an issue with. I love those punches. How good are they? They're sick, man. It's it's so fun. Puts a lot of damage into him there, didn't I? Well, it felt like it. See, we're just whittling this guy away. He, he doesn't even stand a chance, to be fair. If he hits those moves, though, he's brutal. See, that's a weird angle. That, that sort of trips me out when, when the angles go like that.
All right, that's that first stage done. Yeah, I've beaten the game with zero deaths. It's just not not in this run. Let me change that title, eh? I'll change it after this fight, so I don't piss anyone off. Okay. Here comes the Lowe's, our favorite. You actually get some get some damage on him. Look how minuscule it is. It's not even worth it. I knew that was a low, and I still didn't block low. Predictable, man. Predictable. I got your number, bro. It's hard to talk and do these bosses, so bear with me, guys. Look at him. He just keeps coming at me. He doesn't want to commit to anything. This is hilarious. Dude, you're just giving me free meter at this point. Are you okay, man? He wants me to make the move. Well, sure. I'll make the move. You can just sit here and play my play your games all day, man. And then he finally hits the low. Cool, man. It's not a 50-50, man. I know what you're doing. I know what you're doing, man. No, I know what you're doing. He's not committing to the combo at all here. Oh, I'm low. Okay, we've got to concentrate. There you go. See at the end there, man? That that becomes a little bit scary because he's just not committing to anything and I'm not committing to anything either. So I'm just sitting there just, just weaving. But you've got to rely on your pure weaving and avoiding skills there to, to do that um, with the pressure on, especially if you're going for a no-death run. So I just cleared the club with we had a death did we in the club we had one death in the club I think um, we're going to unlock the slide kick really good tool slide kick alright let's keep going guys so we can get this 100% for you guys on here Dog boy, thanks for becoming a member, man. I appreciate it. Thanks for the six months, brother. The king is back. Long time, Dan. Hope everything's good, man. Everything's well, brother. We're back into the swing of things. I hope you're well, man. What have you been up to? What have you been playing? Let me know, brother. Good to have you here. I didn't spare him! Oh, fuck. <laughs> Don't worry, don't worry. We've got time for that. We've got time for that. Don't worry, don't worry. I'll spare him. 
We've got to go back to the club anyway. Shit. How do I f fumble that football? So watch this. Square, square, triangle. Grab the knife off this guy. Right? Now I'm going to show you a little neat trick here. First, we're going to take this guy out. Okay. This baseball bat guy just wants to ruin everyone's day. That's all right. He can do that. Okay, man. You're, you're really ruining my day, man. Okay. You... Why? Why do you want to do this? Watch this, guys. Ready? Yeah, that didn't work. I'll show you in a second. Essentially, there's a there's a really cool maneuver that you can do. I think have we unlocked it. Maybe we haven't unlocked it. Hold on. No, we haven't unlocked it. That's why. Yeah, no. Forgive me. Collectible there, museum map. Now, eventually, you'll be able to go up this elevator from the start and skip all of this. But we have to unlock that first. Now, there's one annoying part of this map where there's these two women. They, uh, they stuff me around a little bit. Okay, hold on a second, guys. Just quickly fixing something here. Alright. Okay. I don't remember office workers being so athletic. I know, right? Uh, <laughs> I should know about that guy. I don't know how I forgot about him. Alright, this guy here. Three heavies. Move back. One heavy. Move back. Dead. That's an easy way to deal with him. I'm going to pick the knife back up. I think the knife's better than the baseball bat, personally. Now, this is a cheese way here. Watch this. See these little mannequins? You can throw them. Just bang. 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 Get involved. Oh, that takedown didn't work for some reason there. Weird. Grab the baseball bat. Come over here. You still got three more to use on this guy. You might as well throw him. He seems to like them. Grab the knife off him. Do a little slide. Oh, we actually blocked that? Good on you, pal. Good on you. Thank God the enemies who use the bats know only to swing way head level twice. Every time. <laughs> head level, yeah. Exactly. They don't know how to swing low. They never swing low. All right. Okay, I want to throw this guy off the edge. I don't know about you guys. I, okay, I've got to throw this guy off the edge. Hold on. Can I throw him if he's got the knife? Yeah. Now, that's a trophy. Yeah, that's a trophy. Be like water, my friend. Throw someone into the fountain. So that's a achievement trophy that you guys can get there. Moving on. You're him, aren't you? You're the one that took down Shark. Yeah, they do, don't they? They specialize in um, fighting games. I never play Absolver, but I know that people loved it. These guys are predictable. They just do the three um, punches with the um, with the delayed punch. See that? Every time, they're easy. Just throw these at him if you're if you're struggling. Look how many there are. If you're just struggling, just throw them. But just remember, look at the range they got on me there. Like, they really got some range off. So just be careful with that. Um, did I have a weapon in my hands that they got rid of? Yeah, we want that weapon. It'll let me pick it up. <laughs> Breaks into a museum. There's a cool Easter egg up here too for Absolver. So they can get hit by that needle in the middle. If you just sort of keep the fight around the middle. See that? 
but you can also get dazed, so you got to be careful. Now watch this. I'm going to pick up that baseball bat. Watch this guy. Careful here. Got to be careful. There's, there's so many around. Just trying to work this crowd nicely here. Always two shots to the head with a baseball. It's very predictable. We've avoid, avoid on the head. Fairly simple stuff there. We're going to gain that. A useful tip with a knife. You can one-shot enemies by holding heavy attack. Exactly. Exactly, brother. That's what I wanted to show off here. It's really helpful. I'll show it off in a in a certain area. Oh, actually, I might show it off against this guy. If I can parry him. Right, let's just watch this. Watch this, right? So strong sweep on the ground. And then you hold it and you can kill him. But I don't have the skill unlocked right now. So exactly what you're saying would have worked there, but I don't have the skill unlocked. So I'll get it. I should have just got it. We were just at a shrine. It's alright. I'll get it next time. Whoa, this guy's... This guy's interesting. This guy's really interesting. Showing off some patterns I didn't even know. Ooh, hear that crack? Take the knife. I, I just prefer the knife over the baseball bat. I don't know about you guys. Now, there's a broom there. This chick over here, like, she's not actually that hard at all. If you use that trick you were talking about, um, Techno Pirate. You can just use that trick on her and she's done, like... Okay, this part's probably one of the more difficult exchanges, just because these guys rush at you. See how they, this guy runs? It's really, it's kind of creepy. Oh, there's two of them, I forgot. No wonder this is annoying. So I just, I just sort of space myself as much as I can here. You know? And then I try and take a weapon off. He just killed him for me. So now I can grab that weapon and make some impact. Again, you can afford to get hit here. He just ran through a wall, that guy. Okay. Who just hit me then? You bastard. See, I'm getting getting health. Thank God you can get health from takedowns in this game. Otherwise, it'd even be more brutal. See, there's my dodging skills on display. Let's give her an eye strike. Oh no. Okay. We better not. Uh, what else have we got here? Oh, Jesus. I poke this guy. And he's done. So that's how you take that room out. That was a very unorthodox way of doing it, but... Whatever works, works, eh? Now, you oh, I could have one-shotted this guy up here if I had the skill. Stop this meaningless crusade here. What age would you recommend people be at when reaching the final stage? Um, Turn around and leave now. One, three, six, Nobody outruns their past. ten. Wrong. Probably... Max 50, just to be safe. What do you want, BNS? What do you want, mate? Let me know. Got to watch those throws. They're deadly. For some reason, these guys don't really phase me that much. I don't know why. I, they're actually not... They're not bad. Watch this, you can actually hit him here as he comes in. See that? Get that final strike. Now I've got the museum key card so I can skyrocket through this level next time. Okay. Where are we now? 
Oh, we're heading towards the, the end. Okay. I'm going to grab... Uh, oh, I need to grab the this skill I'm talking about, right? Which one is it? Charged back fist. It's going to be very handy, this one. This one you want to unlock. Permit unlock. That one. Very, very handy maneuver. You'll see soon, guys, why. Um, phew, might go maximum structure. It's pretty low at the moment. Now you go through here. Well, that answers that. Thanks. I replayed stage one and two, so I wouldn't be too old, but I just wanted to see. Well, what are you on, man? What are you on? I'm interested to know. I love this level. I absolutely love this one. Sick. The rain coming in. They literally just made this to have an excuse for a little rain fight, I reckon. So sick. It actually gets a bit tricky towards the end, this one. Let's uh, sweep this guy, grab his knife, grab his machete. You get the machete here, you really got it, got it good. So you see I'm actually weaving all these guys. Yeah, they... She actually threw that? You can actually push enemies into other enemies as well. Oh, man. These guys are... Oh! That was nice. That was nice. Uh, these actual chicks are really annoying. I can't see a thing! I can't see a thing, man. Oh my goodness. So you let him come. Let him come. After she does that little dance show. Man. And there you go. That's how easy it is to die in that section. Um, what are my tips for this one? I think my my focus is quite low for this one. And this all this guy's also brooding in the in the background. These again, these these women are usually my hardest for some reason for my playstyle. They're they're my hardest opponents. They've got so many strings. Like, it never ends. It's, it's unbelievable. Just watch your tips for the second boss. And didn't take any damage in the first phase. Nice, man. I love to hear that. I can't believe I'm struggling with this area. You know why, guys? I never go through the museum anymore. I've actually got to practice at this part. Yeah, you just sort of, you just got to sort of work them out, work them over a little bit, let them come to you. Watch this. Let him come and then sort of dodge him. Let him dodge. Let him come, dodge him. Just dodge. Look, see, it's much easier. She's got three big hitting moves in a row. She is not to be fucked with. Shit. I need to come up with a better strategy for that area. Shit. These two are a bit of a pain, actually, as well. Oh, see that move there? We just unlocked that one. Very good for crowd control situations see that one really nice move
Ooh, that was nice. That was very nice. Slide kick these two. You like that? What? What? Okay. Again, usually I um the speed run is much easier than the full full game run for a no death run. Obviously, because it's like half the length, half the enemies, half the crowd situations. But um I think that's the reason why I'm I'm on age twenty six at the moment, because I'm not used to doing full run throughs. I'm usually, you know especially the museum. The museum's like, I don't know, I just, I don't really like the museum. I think it's because it's the most challenging for me in terms of room fights. Like, I don't know about you guys, do you struggle at the, um, do you struggle at the sanctuary? The guys who've made it there, do you struggle at the sanctuary? Do you struggle at the sanctuary going up the stairs there with all those different enemy types? Because I find that so easy. And then I struggle with these two fucking bitches in the rain. <laughs> uh, it's pretty funny. Legs for days. Who's the hardest boss in your opinion aside from Yang? Uh, second boss? Second boss? Okay. I'm going to show you how to take this guy out easily. You ready? Strong sweep. Hold circle. And then hold triangle. Our consciousness is and that did not work. Am I doing something wrong? Let's try that again. Well, I still took all of his health, but what am I doing? Am I... Oh, is it holding square? No? What am I doing wrong? Someone will tell me in the chat, please. Tell me what I'm doing wrong, pirate. Okay, this guy's become unblockable all of a sudden. What am I doing? Am I doing something wrong? It's whole triangle for a charge back fist. Maybe that doesn't one shot him. Maybe that doesn't one shot that specific enemy, guys. So usually what I just did then, the sweep into that would, would work. I believe. Let's keep moving on. This is a trap door here. Straight through. I love the art style of this. This is amazing stuff. I love this. So this chick here, you can just see. If you look at her, you can see her moving. Yeah, it stuns him. It doesn't one-shot him. But that can one-shot enemies, that strategy. If you have the skill unlocked, so I have no idea why that didn't work. Unless there's another skill. Yeah, 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 I'm pretty sure it's just that enemy, man. Actually, I'm gonna... What, what's it? Here's a strategy, guys. My focus is low here, and I know there's two bitches coming up, right? So I'm gonna use these easy enemies, right? I'm gonna use these easy enemies to block. See that? To gain some focus. You like that idea? Use them as minions. Actually, I'm just going to make it one so it's easier to deal with. Come over here, lovely. And just let her come at me. Just so I can get this focus meter... Up. I'm happy to even take the damage, dead set. I'm happy to take the damage there. Because these two at the these two here really give me trouble for some reason. These two in here. Love the art style, I love the colouring. The visuals. These two freak me out, man. These two freak me out. This is something out of Blade Runner. Alright, strong sweep. Ready? Strong sweep again. Charge back fist? Doesn't work. Wow. 
All right, now I'm going to be able to take this this girl out there with a slide. See that slide? Watch the slide. Really helpful. Let's try it again, actually. She catches on to it the second time. Oh, this is so trippy, this level, man. Oh, she goes low. You can't see a thing. You can't see a thing. No. Oh. Man, I find that so stressful, that part. Now you've got the elevator key, so now you can literally never see... This is why I never verse these chicks. Because I've got the elevator key. I don't need to verse them. That's half the reason I'm rusty on this area. You can throw your weapon on them just before they strut. You can too. You can too. Alright, the final boss of this level. Hmm... Uh... Get some focus regain. This is probably my favorite boss in the look, like the look of it, especially the second phase. Oh, looks so cool. It is, it's like Kill Bill. And the music is sick. Now, before we get into this, there's a cheese for this. There's a cheese for this. I think it's the crotch punch. So up, up, square, over and over. Let's try this out. Apparently this works. Let's try this out. If I can do it. Hold on, where's my weapon? I need the weapon. Okay. Let's try this. Let me just see what that's... Crotch punch up, up, square. Okay. It's working. Up, up, square. Wow. What a cheese. Look at that. Half health. Wow. What a tactic. So guys, there's a little bit of cheese for you. The crotch punch. Up, up, square. Crotch punch heavy, heavy, over, over. Okay. Okay. He will... <laughs> I'm not going to forget the spare this time. Not going to forget the spare. But I am going to die. <laughs> I am going to die. Weapon mastery. Continue to use a weapon until it breaks completely. Oh, all that does is just... Yeah. It's not useful for this one. How did you survive my blades? Because they're not that actually good. Hold on. Oh, it's, is it up, up? I keep forgetting up, up. Sorry. I, don't, I never use the crotch punch. You've got to forgive me. Wow, that's crazy damage on that crotch punch. I still got to work it out. I'm not fully, don't fully have it yet. But that makes it a lot faster for the speed run. So I will use that. Yeah, use the cheese, guys. Crotch punch. Now, this is sick. 
And I actually really enjoy this second phase, personally. I actually find it quite fun. Now, I, know, I, I can't forget to spare her. Have I still... How have I still got the knife? How the hell is this knife still going? How did that work? Just got to build our structure up if I want to. If I want to beat her, just going to whittle her down a bit at first. Does this the crotch punch work in this? It, does the crotch um crotch punch work in this phase of the fight, mate? I I should try it. I'm guessing it does. Let me try it. No, I I'm not sure it does on the second phase. Nah, I don't think it does. Oh, that bitch got me with the third. Alright, I gotta let her come at me now. I gotta get her structure down. Come on. Whoa! Whoa, man! You're not nice! You're not nice! Alright, don't break her here. Don't break her here. Get up! Jesus. Alright, she's nearly there. Hopefully I don't die. I want to save this life. But it's no guarantees when you're going for a spare. Bang, there we go, nice. Permanent skills, man. Uh, sweep. Environmental mastery. The... Uh, one shot with the blade, whatever that one's called. Hold triangle. Um, weapon mastery. Yeah, there's a few. Stay away from some of those focus attacks, like focus attacks, like the thigh cut or the face smash. Those ones are just sort of trivial, in my opinion. So that is the third boss down. Two to go. Oh, you don't actually see the achievements on, on on the stream, do you? But they're popping up for me. See, I thought they pop up for you guys as well. But they don't. Alright, and we're heading into the fourth part now. Oh, this tree's blossomed. I didn't even know that. That's sick. Because it's a different time of the year. That's actually sick. I... I didn't even know that this entire time. That is so funny. Another nice little detail, eh? 2.16 a.m. As we head into the tower at night. Ah, so this one's at 9. This one's at 7, 3. Is this all in one day? Is he getting this done in one day? I can't tell. Nah, it's not one day. Surely. Skills make it grow. Oh, 
really? Ah, uh, Prince, you know a fuck ton about this game, eh? You've been putting in the work, eh? Can you stop being so good at this game? You make us look like trash. Uh, brother, how you doing, man? How's dying like going? You can take, you can take these guys out, by the way. If you want to, there's a little collectible over here, and we are going to go back and get those collectibles. And that's an elevator there. Okay, this guy here, he's going to attack you no matter what, so I might as well just deal with him now. He's a he's an asshole. Whoa! I don't know if that's a glitch or something, but I've found that this elevator is very glitchy. Yeah, this elevator, for some reason this fight in the elevator is very, very glitchy. So, oh well, we got it done. All eyes on head to Horizon, man. Yeah. Bad game journalists hate him. Yeah, oh, I don't know. Some of those reviews, I just couldn't believe. I, I don't know how these guys do it for a living. I just didn't understand. Oh, she just really hurt me then. That bitch. It's that. Oh, she's. Jeez, she's a fucking brute. How tall are you? You're like seven foot? You're like seven foot, bitch. Whoa, she's like spasming out here. Jeez, man. I don't remember this being that difficult. I like how she's got all women sort of assistants. That's pretty cool. That computer, we're going to gain access to that very shortly. We'll come back to that for people that want to know how to do that. All right, this guy, this guy goes first. Gone. Block this guy. Throw him. Finish this guy off. Bang. Oh, that's a nice little animation. Oh, did you see that? That's glitching out. Look. Oh, that's a bit of a cheese. Hold on. We'll play with this in a second. Let him come here. This is cheesy. That's cheesy. Come here, little big fat boy. I shouldn't say fat. That's, that's very rude. He's a very big boy. He's a strong man. Always use this environment. I sort of haven't been using it the last few levels. What is the fucking carry on that? Did you see that? She got me from across the freaking map. I just like doing that move, hence why I was whiffing. Don't you gain more attack power but lose more health the older you get? Correct. Yeah, I want to do a run where I'm 70 years old on my last... Yeah, he's overweight. Okay. I want to do a run where... I'm level 70 and I go through the entire game to see the difference uh, in terms of how that damage works out because you've also got the less health so it probably works out the same in the end I'm guessing he has big bones exactly right now you kick them down the stairs here if you want to cheat square square triangle to kick him down the stairs. I'm just going to finish that one off. Oh, jeez. Alright. Well, actually, you can actually throw them as well. I might try and throw this chick. Watch this. Ready? It's very awkward, the throw. Not awkward, but... um, What's the word? Glitchy. Isn't it?
Look at these camera angles. They've, they've got to fix that. Just becomes a bit weird. Am I going in here? I've completely forgotten. Uh, no, down here. Why do you spare them? Why? For a good ending. Whoa, music really stuffed up then. She goes... I've never seen her go... Aggressive before. What? I've never seen her go aggressive. That is scary. I'm just going to try and work everyone over. Oh, we'll, actually, we'll, use, the, we'll use the cheat on her. We use the cheese. Doesn't work on her. She's too powerful. The music's just stopped. There's been a glitch. This guy's got no care for women whatsoever. This guy. Yeah, I am on fire. Thank you, honey. Whoa, Danny boy. Okay, he's done. One less to worry about. That's unblockable. Low, you bitch. Maybe she stopped talking while we fought. She might have beat me. It would suck if they had guns. Shit. Oh, you know what I thought? I thought these guys should do a John Wick game. With the with the incredible fucking level design and and gameplay that they've put on put on for us here, how good would it be if they did a John Wick game? I'd love to see that. I'm gonna pick up this broom for this part, this elevator ride. I'm not a fan of. I always find it tricky. Yeah. Uh, to throw them in the right direction, yeah. This voice acting is so subpar. Thank God the gameplay is fantastic. Alright, this guy is actually quite annoying, in my opinion. Because, because of this fucking camera movement and shit in the elevator, it becomes like really awkward for me. I made short work of him there, so... These two are, are pretty self-explanatory. If you can just get a nice little sweep off, that helps. Music gets intense, man. It's sick. I've actually lost lost a bit of health here. This isn't even the hard part of the level either, by the way. It is pretty sick. Like you're falling on it. You're fighting on a falling elevator. They've thought of everything. I'm not gonna lie. It's pretty sick. I sort of hate this area though. This area here. I don't know. Now. I don't know. I'm just going to show you guys this anyway, because we're not worrying about deaths. If you go down here, you get an achievement trophy, but you also die. So, I thought I'd show you that. And you also save, like, save an area, but, it, like, you might as well play through that area because it's not actually that hard anyway, in my opinion. So you've just sort of skipped that whole little little part. Now this chick here, people find a real nuisance. This one here. She's got some mix-ups. She's got some mix-ups. There's no weapon around either. They don't make it easy. It's a really awkward fight. It's a really awkward fight, in my opinion. 
That's why I don't like this fight at all. I don't even know how that hit, because I blocked that. So it's a high, high, and a low, that one. So look, I didn't I didn't make her look very good, but she actually can be quite annoying for a lot of people. Yes, I'm going to do that on her. I'm going to try that with the machete. I might try that that trick again. The one-shot trick. I can definitely do it on the last level. I know that. Camera angle's very awkward in this area. I found it. Wow, she spawned already? Oh, that's not good. That is not good news. That is not good news. What? He just teleported. He just teleported. I'm dead here. I am dead as a doorknob here. Oh my god. I'm clutching on the straws here. Oh. How am I alive? I'll never know. I'm dead. Okay. Now we can reset. Now we can reset. Oh. He literally... I literally got screwed over here. Because this other guy was in the fight. What you want to do here is you want to isolate the chick with the machete. See that? And now I can pick up that machete. And make short work of these guys. But I'm not going to... Going to worry too much here. Oh man, a lot of dodging when there's two of them. That wouldn't even let me do that then. Look, it's it's almost impossible when you got both of them coming at you like that. It's it just makes it so difficult. That actually is a... The, the reason that that fight is so difficult, for me anyway, you've got this chick who's got a bunch of different highs and lows. You've got him who's unrelenting. And then you've got this chick with a machete. The key is to take her out instantly and then use her ability to take um, the other chick out with the focus attack. And then you've got the guy solo. So I just made a mockery of it, but... Um, Oh, this game with a Batman theme. What a great idea. Although, I mean, yeah, Arkham has similar combat, doesn't it? Very similar combat. Now, let's try this um, one-shot attack on this chick. Let's see if it works. Oh, I need to build up my meter. So, I'm just going to let her hit me. Ah, uh, thank you. All right. So now you do strong sweep, hold circle, and then hold triangle. Yes, there we go. And you get an achievement for it as well. So that's how you take her out quite easily. But now I don't have the machete. Well, guess what? Yeah, I do. There's one over here in the corner. <laughs> So that's a nice little trick there, guys, to deal with her very easily. And it works on all those types of enemies besides the big boy. It is broken, yeah. I think it's a, I think it's really helpful. Okay. These two are the probably the easiest enemies you'll face. And I think it's just so you can gain a little bit of health back. Because I look at my health at the moment. Although it is gonna it is gonna go back anyway, isn't it? Yeah, I think it just goes back anyway. It goes to full anyway. 
And we're up to the final boss. We're going to go parry because we're going for sparing. We're going to spare her here. It's easy to one-shot enemies if you do an eye poke. Ah, oh, yes. Yes, 100%. You're right. My mistake. The eye poke. You won revenge. And to restore that which once was. But that suffering, it was for something. Yours, mine, even Yang's. We did something for the people. We shared. You want to erase it all? Deathless achievement? No. Tech, there isn't. Legacy. Can you only do that move with a knife? Yes. Yes, Cash. You can only do that move with a knife. Correct. Where's my knife? There it is. So, very easy patterns there, guys, to remember. I've done a guide on this, if you want to see it. She's by far the easiest boss, in my opinion, especially this first stage. She, she's literally piss easy, guys, like I'm telling you. I just make her look good because I'm bad. Oh, what? Are you serious? What? How did that happen? That was weird. Anyway. We move on. Now what? Falling elevator. I'm so bad at blocking any tips. Head into the punching bag area. Head into the practice and just keep practicing with your timing on the dummy training area in the home base. Uh, keep practicing the first level and just literally just block. Don't even attack. Just keep blocking. Oh, I actually got to get some meter here, don't I? Yeah, hold on. Well, she's actually going to kill me here because I'm fighting around like a headless chook. Actually, how do I gain the meter here on her? I've actually got to block these, don't I? Yeah. How do I spare her here? I forgot. Like... I guess you just got to parry your attacks. Hold on, let's let me get close to her. Is that working? No, it's not. That's not working. Do I just have to attack? I just got to attack her even when she's hurt. This is the one I actually struggle with the most to spare. I remember now. She's annoying. She's really annoying to get the sparing off. I'll probably die one more time trying to get this done. Nearly there. Let's... Yeah, that actually works. You're right. Yeah, that's working. Except I'm taking a shit ton of damage for it. All right. That's done. Now one more time. She's floating in the air right now. Does anyone see that? Nearly there. 
There we go. What? 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 I just got screwed. Are you joking? What? Am I... I press spare. Well, alright. Well, i got to parry her now. I'm probably going to take another life. I don't know what happened there. I think I accidentally punched her. She's about to... There we go. Spare. That was weird. I, I, someone replay that? I don't know what happened. That was bizarre. Her second phase is much more OP. First phase is a breeze. Second phase is still easy, but when you're trying to spare, it makes every fight just that little bit harder. You know? And a lot of people, a lot of you guys probably don't even know that you can spare the boss fights. You don't have to kill them. It's a glitch, or did I punch her? Steven, I punched her, did I? There you go. Alright, let's get into this final... F Whoa, this tree is blossoming, man. This is sick. I didn't even know. How's your unlock? So what happens if I unlock every... Everything? I've actually never unlocked everything. In a playthrough before. That's so cool. Love that. All right, the sanctuary. How high up were you to be able to free fall in an elevator for two minutes? <laughs> Pretty high up, man. Pretty high up. Do spare persist between runs or do I have to spare them in one continuous run I don't know we're actually going to find out here what happens guys because I didn't spare the second boss so I'm actually curious to see what happens here when I spare him at the end if there's a different ending I don't I don't know we're going to find out because we've spared three or four bosses guys Remember, we didn't spare the second. See, that's an easy way to take this guy out. You just kick him off. Again, using the environment, guys, is your, is your key. No, you can't, bitch. Oh, I didn't say come on. Whoops. Uh, collectible here. Newspaper. Now, can someone tell me in the chat, what's in this room? Is there anything I need? There's this... I don't really want to go in there. Fuck it. Come on, we got to, it's a hundred percent playthrough. We're not fucking around here. That slide kick, guys, really helpful. Triangle, 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 triangle. Oh, that doesn't work on him. Okay. Oh, let me try again. Nah, it doesn't. Now it will. Ready? Puts him on the ground. Yeah. So only when you actually counter him. Yeah, this is a pretty easy room. Okay. What is in here? It's this thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What do we want for the final boss? We want structure. Don't we? Is there anything here? There's a machete, yeah. There's a machete here you can grab. Nothing else. We move on. I think they persist. All I know is that I only spare first four bosses once, but when I spared the final boss the second time, it's a different run. I still got the spared all bosses ending. Oh, you can throw them out in the window? I don't think you can, man. I don't think you can. I think I've tried that. I think I tried that. I don't think you can. Yeah, I'm 99% sure you can't. All right, so in this room, guys, there is a secret room for anyone that doesn't know. First, you take this guy out. This guy's easy. Watch 
Bang, bang, bang. Throw that on him. Bing, big, big. Sweep. I mean, he's just pathetic. This poor, he's just trying to clean. I've just come and ruined his day. Sent him to hospital. Now we head into this secret room here. This was one of the keys we got very super early. And in here, we get the flower key. Which is for that first room. In the first level. So we can finish off that first level. Quite easily. Now they've got these two massage therapists down here. These two here. If you attack this guy quick, he goes instantly. And sweep him. He's gone. Nothing else there to explore. Nothing else here. Here. Voice crack. Now, I'm just going to kill these son of a bitches. Stuff it. I'm going to just... I'm a fucking killer. Yeah, you angry bitch. No. Enough with your terrible outfit. Are you Tarzan or something? Like, what are you trying to do? She's pretty straightforward. Now we move on to this next section. I hate this room. I'll probably die. For some reason, I hate these two. It is an honor. It is an honor as I smash her guts in. There we go. It wasn't that hard. There's actually nothing in here. The only thing is you can... I don't know. What is it? What's the point of that room? Uh, I don't even know what the... Oh, you have to go through that room. Because you can't go through here. Oh, I couldn't go through anyway. Right. Right, right, right. I was fine with randomly jumping in someone's turf and beating them up first stage because they were drug makers. This is coming to someone's established illegally. <laughs> Yeah, this is like a nice sanctuary, like, massage parlor. I wouldn't mind going here. You know? <laughs> Shit. What's in here? I I, oh, the key is in here. Right. Right. Yeah. Relax and enjoy your session. That sounds sort of creepy. No, I'm not going to lie. All right, let's use the environment. Why? Did you see that? Where was that going? What the? Just keep using that environment to your... Bang, bang, bang. They broke the chair. Thanks, guys. Oh, machete's there. The, um, the knife's here. No wonder. Okay, I gotta watch it here. Just keep your distance... Keep coming in. Don't want to get hit by those kicks or you'll fucking get smashed like me. Now I'm minuscule health. This could be it for me. There's one down. Finish him. Play it safe here. Bang. So now you get the key? Yeah, you get the key. Yeah. There you go. A middle-aged man just killing a beady or your co workers for no reason. Well, there is a reason. I mean, he's on a revenge tale. The slow cap to make a game based on a mainstream franchise tone down the difficulty. Yeah. I guess so. I like the... I don't think the game's that difficult if you put the work in, man, though. Like, seriously. It is difficult. Don't get me wrong, but... I love the learning curve of this game. Okay, there you go. Um, I might get a permanent unlock. Oh, no, I don't need it. Don't worry. Okay. Uh, I don't want some more, actually, to be, to be fair.
Now, what? He goes in. He goes raged? I did not know that, that he goes to rage mode. All right. Can you throw rage mode people? Let's find out. There's a trophy here for throwing them off this edge. So let's see if this works. I don't know if I can throw these guys. Hold on. Yeah, I don't know if this is going to work. You can only throw basic enemies, eh? No, that's not right. You can throw him. Maybe you can't throw enraged people. Uh, let me try and... I'll kill this chick. Ah, if you're weapon mastery, you get to throw the machete before it goes. See, I'm learning things, thanks to you guys, eh? Alright. Ah, I've picked up that weapon. That was dumb, actually. Let me pick up this brick. God. Fuck off. Jesus Christ. Can I throw this guy off? I don't think I can. No, wrong way. <laughs> wow, okay. Oh. <laughs> okay. And that's how you get a trophy. Just like that. <laughs> it's funny. You can throw anyone. I, I didn't know you could throw anyone. You can throw boss. Yeah, you, I didn't know you can throw anyone off the roof. I guess I should clarify. Alright, come on, bitch. I love dodging those kicks that he does. I find that so fun. Okay, everybody. Let's see what happens here, because I forgot one boss. So I'm guessing one of them's not going to light up. That one does. That one doesn't. Yeah, right. That one will. And this one... Yep. Okay, so that's... Interesting. You're going to try and beat the warehouse at age 75? these journalists no offense if there's any in here a lot of the game journalists are just not good at games for whatever reason I don't know how they're great at writing a lot of them but they're not good at gaming so I think that is we need more like decent gamers that are journalists um, because giving this game a 4 out of 10 because you found it difficult is just and they'll argue that's not the reason but it is we all know it is okay I don't think I've ever had yeah I don't, I don't want that stick in this fight Who's going to give me some tips for this fight? What are we missing here? I mean... 
There must be some tips I'm, I'm missing for this fight. How did I not block that? What? Oh, I love blocking that. That is so fun. Stop going backwards, man. That's not the combo I wanted. I'm so dead here. I might as well just die, yeah. I'm just gonna die. I hate having that much health. I just don't perform well. H34 for a 100% playthrough where I'm talking and not like really concentrating. That's not too bad, really. I'm happy with that. How many deaths have I had? Does anyone know that's been here since the start? Five or six deaths? It's not bad. Oh, I love that. Come on. That's so fun. So fun. Any other combos, guys, that we should be using here? Whoa, he hit me there. Try harder, he says. You're doing good so far. Yeah, it's pure hand skill, isn't it? Ooh, that trick, that string. He doesn't do very often that string. You'll find. Oh, I love that. So good. So good. All right, I gotta spare him. Oh, you can get him with a range strike. Okay. In the end, you're still that same child. Jason, we're about to do that. Once I beat him, I'll show you. Okay. You're here. But essentially, once you get to here, you go into a secret room in the sanctuary to get that key. You sound like a frightful. I actually really enjoy this second part of the second part of the boss. I actually quite enjoy it. Except I'm forgetting to block low for some reason. Oh, you gotta watch out for that one. He has this sort of unblockable move. What? Well, where you come at him. I forgot about that one. Let's see who didn't teach you this one. Wow. I'm not playing well on this one. I'll get him. I'll probably just die once here and then and beat him. So I'll be age 35. By the looks of it. You never know, I might be able to beat him here. If I put in the work here, you never know. I might be able to beat him here. Boom, boom, boom. Oh, I'm starting to learn his techniques now. You're not so good now, mate. Watch him get a sneaky fucking low on me here. Oh, the low. Look at my health. The low. Oh, come on, I, I can't die. I can't die. I got him. I got him. Come on. Oh no, I've got to spare him. I've got to spare him. I've got to spare him. Thank you for reminding me. I've got to spare him. Look at my health. It's literally, there's no health. Yeah, I'm dead. There was literally no health. 
It's so satisfying, man, for me as well. Dodging his punches, so satisfying. You're better off weave. Ooh, you're better off weaving that. I'm gonna die again here, this bitch. This bloody bitch is gonna kill me again. Come on, Dan, you got this. Got this, Dan. Come on. Spare him. Here we go. Final boss. Why does he get me with that punch? He gets me with that punch. I don't know. That's weird. Why can't I... Sp oh, you can't spare him. How's that, guys? You can't spare him unless you've spared all the bosses. Very interesting. Didn't know that. Did not know that until then. So I can't actually spare him here. I've just got to kill him. So I've literally wasted five minutes. There you go. So we get the bad ending after all that. That's right. We'll come back. I mean, it makes sense. I guess we're doing a 100% walkthrough, so we've got to show both endings. You know? Why don't I throw bosses? You reckon it's a good idea to throw bosses? I mean, actually, probably the, the inverted throw might be good where you reposition the boss to maybe get some extra hits off him. That probably would work. Yeah, this stream will be saved, mate. So don't you worry. It'll be going up as a VOD. So anyone can come back and watch exactly what I do. Don't you worry, brother. the other one he can break him his hands go out like lightning and the other doesn't want to fight you can't throw yang there you go techno what's your best run by the way what's your best aged run exactly tech exactly mate now i want to see this fucking tree it should be booming, man. It should be breaking out of the seams of the fucking house with all the skills I have. What the fuck? Oh, I'm back to zero? Oh, of course. Okay, let's get all these collectibles, guys. 15 or 17. What are we missing? Uh, I know exactly what we're missing here. 15 of 17. Appreciate the vids. Can you tell us exactly how you avoid or weave the lightning fast combos? Do you hit L2 super fast or hold it? I hold L2 and I'm spamming down on the analog stick. Right? Listening to the to the, the mic? Hear that? Yeah, so we've got two collectibles to get in this map, guys. So what I'm going to do is I'm sort of going to cheat. I'll show you in a minute. So I have no skills now because I permanently unlocked nothing, which is not the way to go. So now instead of going up here, you go through the shortcut on the left because we've got the key from beating this map earlier. Okay, so you can go straight through this door and you pretty much save 20 minutes off this playthrough or 15 minutes, I reckon. Hey you! 
on PC, because this is ultra settings, um, on PC there's a couple of frame drops when you enter new areas sometimes. Only a fool would come here, and you're the fool. That's the point. I'm gonna just. I wonder if you can throw a guy off here. Let's try it. Ooh! That's even worse. That's even worse, man. So now we're going to come through here. How can I unlock this door? Once you once you finish this level, you unlock that door, man. You just have to beat this level or get to the end boss. I believe. Is that right, guys? Get to the end boss and you'll unlock that door. Then you come through here. Now you got this fight. Problem only problem with this is now this fight becomes a lot more harder. Because you gotta deal with um, three more enemies. Just be careful not to overcommit here. Oh, I don't even have the fucking Oh wow, really? Are you serious? She it even happens to her? Wow. Wow, that's so annoying. Well, to be honest, it doesn't matter here, like, if I die, because we're going for, um... We are going for collectibles now. Oh, that's satisfying, isn't it? Oh, that is satisfying. Block both. I love how they hit, hit each other. Wow, how many strings do you have, man? I'm gonna cheese this bitch. Watch. That's what you get. That's what you get, bitch. Okay, once you move on from there, we go into here. How many times have I finished the game? Five or six? I think. Don't know. How many, from start to finish? I actually don't know. Oh no, I've accidentally hit the wrong guy here. That's alright, this guy's... This big boy is no worries at all. And now we are heading into the final area already. That's how quick this is with shortcuts. Now you see how I did the speed run. You know, it's it's quick. What counter-attack combo deals the most damage? Um, I would say the heavy. Always the heavy. Now we're going to go into this uh, secret room. And we don't even need to take this boss out. We're going to give up. See this? Bang. Oh shit, am I missing something? No, we've got everything. Yeah, yeah we've got everything. Beautiful. So now, in so we don't have to face that boss again, we give up. You lose your skills and everything. But see, now i got 17 out of 17. Now we head into the club. Club, what do we need to do in the club? Shit, i got 9 of 16? Shit, we're missing a few. I know exactly what we're missing, actually. We're missing... Yeah, I know exactly what we're missing. That's alright. Alright. Forget about it. If you're not on the list, you're not getting inside. Private party, come back tomorrow. Okay, come on, mate. Come on. Oh, 
love how this the the tables break and stuff it's fantastic it's so good where did you get the key like i said you get that in the first level oh no the that key then sorry that one is from the secret room in the sanctuary okay that's that that room we just went in you get that key from the fifth mission secret room okay and to get into that secret room you automatically get that key anyway from memory does that make sense guys all right we move on here oh, we're gonna take these guys out again Take him out. I'm doing big heavy attacks here. And it's working. I can't sweep. I keep going to sweep. I haven't unlocked it. I will unlock it in this next shrine. Oh, I haven't even got environmental master either. Yeah. It's because we gave up. This is what happens when you give up. Jeez, I made... Quick work of them, didn't I? You can actually attack her there. And she'll go low here? No. I thought she goes low there. I thought she goes... Does she not go low there? I swear she has a has a low combo. Really low here. No? Uh, maybe I'm going crazy. There it is, low. I don't know why she waited so long. We're going to grab a uh, strong sweep. Now, hold on. We forgot to get the code. Fuck. Okay. We've fucked this completely, haven't we? We'll come back. It's alright. We still need to do the, do the boss. Um... So we need to go this way. So now you got the shortcut here. You can go through here. This is actually funny. What what are you finding funny, man? Thanks, man. I appreciate it. The speed run was a lot of fun, man. I've actually beaten that time since, but it's not worth uploading. I got it to like... I got it to like... 37 or something. You just got to put in the work, man. And you guys will get... You guys will be better than me in a week or two. If you just put in the work. Why are my punches not working? Or am I crazy? Now, once you go through this room, guys, you might not have seen this room, some of you, before, right? Is this is a secret room that um, you unlock sort of when you get the key code, uh, the key card, during when you first play through this level. So, if you just follow this guide, follow this video, you'll be able to unlock everything. If you follow this VOD, if you're coming in late or whatever. I'm just going to sweep him. I just can't be bothered. These guys are easy. They really are. They're not... They're sort of pathetic, really. I can't even see a thing, but I know exactly what this guy's going to do. Come on, mate. We're not here all day. Okay. And now, this is what you want to do here, guys. This is to gain access to the... Computer in the tower level. What you want to do here is you want to go computer access... And you want to say the corporation? Really? You got some nerve going after her. 
And he gives me the key, the USB. That's going to get me into that computer over here. Beautiful. Thank you very much, sir. Okay, what else are we missing in this level, guys? We need to beat the boss still. We need that, that, and that. And the key. Did we never get the fire key? We never got the fire key. So we're going to have to come back anyway. I might actually quit here then. I'm going to quit here to save time. We'll come back to that. Let's head to the museum. Much love, Jared. Much love, brother. You're not laughing at me? Yeah. You're laughing at the game? It's pretty funny. Ah, uh, you get that in the Sanctuary Diamond. You get that key in the secret room. Uh, sorry, not the secret room. The hotel room, I guess you could call it. In the Sanctuary. Which is the fifth level. Okay. Head to the fifth level. And um, make your way there. Okay, we're missing five here. So, we don't need to go through there now. That This elevator is one. So that's done. Now we need to make our way up. I'm actually going to try and throw these guys off. This might work. Hold on. Let me just try this. No, oh, no. Okay. thought you could throw them off these stairs or something. Let me try it again here. Nah, it's just throwing the other way. Okay. We open up here. I don't... Yeah, you got to kill these guys. Beautiful. Now, 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 now. Where are the collectibles here, guys? Someone's got to help me. There's five here. Um... This is pretty insane. This is what I wanted from Sleeping Dogs. Sleeping Dogs was sick, man. Come on. This is an Absolver Easter egg. Let me just bring her over here so I can show you this Easter egg. Can I... Question, can I throw her off here? Does anyone know? Let me try this. I can't parry with the stick, can I? Yeah, I don't... I... I don't know if I'm going to be able to throw her. Nah. She's just going to kill me, probably. If I don't watch it. Probably not good to try to throw this chick off. Probably not ideal. Now, this is an Absolver Easter egg, guys. There's the club code. So now we can go back to the club and get in there. Beautiful. Now, guys, this is a Zolbury strike. Their other game. Look at this. Bang. Strange mask. Absolver. See that? See how it says Absolver? Look Absolver up. The studio that made this game made Absolver. So that's a nice, and that's some art there, I think, from the game. I never played Absolver. Or well, maybe I did. I can't remember anyway. Um. What have we got left here for this detective board museum? We're missing one, two. Hmm. I believe that's the secret room. 
The Secret Room, and what's this other one? Does anyone know? Um, yeah, I think we have to come back. I think we have to come back. Let's move on to the tower. Sanctuary 14 to 16. What are we missing in the sanctuary? We know we're missing the secret ending and we're missing one other thing. What's the one other thing that we missed? What's the one other thing we missed? That's her family photo. Where do you get the family photo, Aaron? Anyway, let's let's get the USB in. You also unlock the Calbot by finding the mask, which is a reference to Absolver, Bitch Slap. Really, really cool Easter egg, yeah. What do you call wave for defense? What do you mean, Thomas? I'm not sure what you mean, brother. Now, if I do this elevator, that's not one? Okay, I thought that was one. Oh no. Oh no, guys. Oh no. Oh no. What a disaster. I'm going to have to restart. Shit. That's happened before as well. Thanks, Tyler. Appreciate it, man. Yeah, people have been fucking eaten alive in this game. I've watched a lot of... um. Sort of a... Yeah. <laughs> Oof. I've watched a lot of streams, man. And, and some of these people are... They're, uh, they're still working it out, I think. Okay. Let's do that again. This time we're just going to maybe let him... Let him, uh, let him go a little bit. I guess you're not supposed to hit him. He sort of. Uh, did you see that? His feet were sort of under. I think they gotta. They gotta patch that. Yeah, this elevator is like. There's a bit of clipping on this elevator. I think you'll find. Okay, let's get this USB in. Not even a scar. Look at your face. I'm certain Yang won't be thrilled to see you again. No, he won't be thrilled because I will kill that motherfucker into oblivion, man. No, give me the fucking weapon. I will not make this mistake again. Give me that weapon. So I can take this butch... Bitch out. Did I say bitch or butch? Butch bitch. Look at her now. She's whittled down compared to last time. That is how you take that room out. Okay, now we can head into this USB area. Okay, and we got the computer done. All right. And then it opens up this secret area. Beautiful. Where I get the artist key. Now, what's that key for? It's for the museum? Hold on, where's this key gone? That key is for here, 100%, if we go back to the museum. Now, what are we missing? We're missing one thing from here. What is this, guys? Does anyone know what this is? Trying to think of this level, what I'm missing. Top floor of museum. Yeah, yeah, I know that. But what? what's this one here? What's this thing here, guys? Is this activated in another level? It's in the safe as well. Oh. Oh, okay. <laughs> Radio. 
Okay, we're done here. Beautiful. I just had to wait another second, you fucking impatient dickhead. Dad. All right, tower's done. Now we can go back to the museum, clean up the museum. And then we're nearly there. Saw some people talk about this game being too flat, lack of content, but man, it seems pretty deep. Gorgeous, man. It's I've played this game for like 30 to 40 hours. It's got a lot of replay value. And I think, you know what? One thing they should add, guys, that I've been thinking about, what about an endless room where enemies just keep coming in waves and you've got a last and there's a leaderboard? That would be sick. Because then you could have bragging rights on the leaderboard. And how many waves can you get to? How many waves can you survive before you die? Like, that's that's something I think they could do, too. I don't think that's out of scope. What do you guys think of that idea? Yeah, you love it? Yeah. I was thinking about this the other day. And, it's, and it should be easy for them to implement. You can have a couple of maps, too. Yeah, see, I, I agree. I agree, I came up with the idea. <laughs> of course I fucking agree. Oh, shit. Put it in the rain room, Tyler. Yes, man. That's a fucking sick idea, bro. The rain room is so cool. It's funnily enough that, I don't know if you were here earlier, but that was, that was the room I struggled in the most in this playthrough. For whatever, I think I died twice in there. Think maybe once, once or twice. Yeah, now that I think we do a survival randomizer would be. Oh yeah, you could also have a same run through of the map of this game, but randomize the enemies. That'd be interesting. And maybe there's a way they can make it so it's still fair because. You know what happens with randomizing. It becomes like you might get an easy run here. You might get a, you know. Oh, you can never get old of this combat, guys. It's absolutely sensational sort of stuff here. They've really nailed it. It's an indie studio, remember. It would make it harder. It's tough if you get used to skipping. Yeah. I'm only missing all the finishing trophies, Aaron. Yeah, so Aaron... What you should try and do, brother, is do all the um, finishes when they're on the ground. Put them on the ground and finish them with weapons and shit. That'll work, man. I'll tell you right now. That's how I got the trophy done. I'm actually the first achiever to get the PS4 Platinum. I don't know if any of you guys knew that. I was the first to get the PS4 Platinum. Um, and... Um, And yeah, so now, bang. I love this room. Really cool. And it gives you an insight on the lore of the character as well. So we know she's an artist, artiste, but look, there's a story behind it. The family photo. She had a twin. That's why she has that second phase. You know, it all makes sense. I think I should do a lore video on these bosses. So we got everything here now. Yep. Beautiful. All right. Now we can. I guess we can head back. Hold on. What am I? What's this one here, guys? Can someone tell me what that one is there? Yeah. Someone tell me. I think you unlock that through the fire chest in level two, if I'm wrong. Let me know. But um, now we're going to head into level two. We're going to spare the boss, get all the collectibles, head to the sanctuary, do that boss again, and we've done it. That's the 100% in terms of the detective board. And we're just going to be just over three hours by the end. Probably three, uh, heading into 3.30 for the full detective board, which is pretty good. Now, not... Many people would do that first playthrough. Let's let's be honest. I, I got a question for you guys. How, for those who finished it, even if you haven't, 
how many hours did it take you to finish the game on your first playthrough? That's my question. How many hours did it take you to finish your first playthrough? And if you haven't finished it, how many hours have you played and what are you up to? Because I know some journalists, man, they dead set took 30 hours to beat the game. 20 to 30 hours. I mean, that's... These, these guys play games for a living. Like... I don't care if you're not good at the game. Couldn't care less. But when you give it a 4 out of 10 and say it was too difficult and you're a games journalist, I don't know. It's a sour taste in my mouth. Yeah, how many hours? So it took you 9 hours. 5 to 6, Aaron. Oof. You're a fucking beast, Aaron, if it took you 5 hours. Jesus Christ, brother. I'm actually going to show you this now. Let's get him over here. Whoa, nice throw, bro. I'm going to try and... Let's just see what I can do here. Ready? Push. Bang. Look, see that health? It's a nice little way to kill people. I love the music in this this fight. How he leads in the music. If you want to see the soundtrack, it's on my channel. Fantastic soundtrack. You can listen to this song and a few others. Who cares? I don't care if I'm dying here. Now I'm rushing. I'm still at 40 hours in grinding everything unlockable. Wow, man. What do you got left? Alright, so now we got the club key, club code. We can push. Oh, we gotta kill these two first. Hold on. Fuck. I'm gonna cheese him. I'm gonna cheese him. Fuck him. See? Much easier. Dead. Alright, now we go into the club. Get the club code out. Key code, sorry. Bang, we head in here. Now we got to take in these two goons. And then we're going to get something out of it. I forgot what we get. Something good. Who's this? Yeah, I think it could be random, man. God, I hate these two. They're really annoying. They're really annoying. Because they just interrupt you when you're trying to kill one of them. They're really... They have no manners. Yeah. They've got no manners, these two. You need the environmental mastery as you come in here. I'm a bit, I'm a bit unequipped for this fight. It's alright. God. You can't even get a punish off. Because the other one will interrupt. What? They both fucking... Oh my goodness. Okay, this guy's gone. Thank God for that. Alright, so now... What do we get? We get the fire key. There you go. And that's how you get into there. I'm still missing three things. Fuck. What am I missing? What the fuck am I missing? Oh, I know what one is. You gotta to talk to the to the martial arts guy. You gotta to talk to the martial arts guy. Through there, we've got the fire key. That's two. And what's the last one? Does anyone know? Do 
Does anyone know? Uh, I think we should be all right. Let's hope so. I think we should be all right here. We've already gone through there, so we go straight through here. And we talk to this guy here. Talk to this guy here. Above this door, the two trials. The trials. What are they? Agility, dexterity, endurance. Bang. So that's that's one. Yeah, it is. Look. So now we've only got two left. Yeah, beautiful. That should be it. Then we head into the fire key, get that, and we're done. This, and then we can get into Shanks Shanksuary. Shanksuary. Sanctuary. Alright, let's open this. Damn, he's on fire. So... If you if you're looking to get all the takedowns, here's a trick. Ready? Hold triangle. Um, do the sweep. Sorry, do the sweep that I just did. Then, when they're low, when they're low on um, so um, that sweep there, when they're low, right? It's a bit tough when there's people everywhere. But what you do is you get them down on the ground low if you want to try and get all the takedowns. And then you get some weapons out. And you start... Fuck, I know. You start um, trying that and you can get all those takedowns done. Come on, hit her for me, mate. You shall not fear death. Stop I also want to do a video, guys, on uh, all the enemy reactions to you waking up. How many trials do I have left before meeting Sean? I wish, I will say, I wish they expanded the training mode more. It kind of baffles me that you train against all the bosses in the intro, but you can't train against anyone else. That is on purpose, Matt. They do that on purpose because think about it, man. If they let you uh, train against anyone, it wouldn't make the game hard. It would make it too easy. You just sit there training the whole time, and by the time you get to the boss, don't you think, man? It'd be way too easy, in my opinion. All right, let's do this one-on-one, -on -one, bitch. Come on. Let's do it old school. Psych. <laughs> Psych. Sorry, bitch. I don't have time for your fucking shantic. Your shantics, your antics. And that is how you clean her up in about five seconds. Now we head into here. We get the fire key. Where is it? Now, does anyone notice something, guys? This is the opening of the level from the start. I don't know if you noticed that. That's This is all burning now. These two guys are gone. Did anyone notice that or is it just me? Or was it obvious? See, and then you're coming down here. Fire key, Sean's father, portrait. And we've got it. What? We're missing something, guys. What's this? What's this? Guys. No. Are you kidding me? What are we missing? What are we missing? Are you joking? Oh, God. The words on the wall? I just did that.
Oh no. The words on the wall. You nah, the words on the wall are here. Look. We're missing something. It's small too. Oh, I don't know what it is. Might have to bring up my other save. Yeah, I'm not sure. I don't know what we've missed. That's annoying. Oh, well. I'm trying to think back. What have we missed? Maybe you got to talk to the guy at the start? Oh, I can't remember. It's hard to... Th I'm doing this off the top of my head, guys. Just, just be wary. Alright, let's take... Let's spare this guy. does a lot more damage than what I was doing normally. I'm going to have to do that from now on. That's going to cut down on the time. Should I pick up the staff here? Probably not, actually. Dan, did you get all the trophies? I did on PS4, man, yeah. You're almost as good as Yang. Ugh, my chair. Squeaky, squeaky chair. Okay. We come in here. He always gets me with the first low, man. I have no idea why. I always get clipped with the first low. I'm literally just doing heavies here, guys. It's pretty boring. I'm trying to just get through this guy now. To spare him. I wonder if you can actually get his structure down if he's not in the fiery mood. If you get hit by that one on the ground, that does a, a ferocious amount of damage. You've got to be careful. God, what is these angles? These camera angles, man. Oh my god. I can't see a thing, man. How is that allowed? Oh my goodness. Yeah, okay. Shit. Do you just parry each time he strikes? Uh, not parry, weave, avoid. L1 and down. And then L1 and up for that one. Oh, actually, he's low on health here. I've got to start getting his structure down. See how I'm blocking these? It's just that last hit you don't want to get hit by. He's nearly done. So I can spare this guy. Come on, mate. We don't have all day for you. Yep, nearly there. And we don't finish him here. Don't finish him here. And now I'm going to... 
I poke him once. I'm gonna eye poke him. No, I'm not. I'm gonna eye poke him again. Because. Now I will. Alright, he's nearly done here. Spare. Beautiful. Yeah, you're getting your ass kicked by. Yeah, exactly, man. You gotta be careful. Alrighty. So that is how you spare him. Now we've spared all the bosses. But we are still missing. We're still missing. One of those fucking things. Why didn't I finish him the first time? So I can get the spare. I could spare him for the good ending, man. There's two endings to the game. Now, I've got no idea what I'm missing on this fucking detective board. Uh, this thing here, I, I can't like, for the life of me remember. Can someone check their game? See what it is? Please. And also, we're missing one here. You know what I might do? Someone, someone check that out for me. Um, I'm just trying to think where it could be. Private Corp. Back off! I'm looking for this one, man. This one right here in the club. See that? Can you check your game if you've if you've played it and just have a look and see? Because I've, I mean, I can check, but I got I got a feeling it's talking to this guy. No, nah, it's not. Oh, actually, I get information out of him at the start. That could be it. Hold on, let's. Let, this could be it. Hold on. Put that down. Please don't hit me. Where is Sean? He, he's with the fighters for, for the burning. Only Sean's disciples have passes to get inside. We'll see about that. Bang. There it is, guys. Fighters need a pass. That's all it was. Beautiful. Thank God for that. I thought we were in for another full playthrough. So 17 to 17, 16 to 16, 19 to 19, 17 to 17. Two more at the sanctuary. And we are done. Thank you for the help, guys. Okay, now we're missing one here. Because the final one is what you get for the good ending. So what is the last thing we're missing here? Does anyone know? Hmm. I know what it is. It's the door. It's the door, is it? That you unlock. I think it's a door. Oh, actually, I know what it is. It's the old man. I killed him last time, if anyone remembers. It's the old man. I'm going to go straight through. I think it's the old... Oh, no. Is that all it is? That door? Yeah, it is. It's that door. 
Beautiful. Now we've only got one left, guys, which is the final boss. Sparing him. And we are 100%ing the game. It's been a beautiful journey. And we are nearly there. And you would not believe the time in Australia right now. Look it up on Google. I'll definitely be sleeping in tomorrow. God, I'm good. <laughs> Hold on, one more... Yeah. Yeah. We're all good. Just check. Now I'm in speed run mode. And I've got no abilities at all, I'm pretty sure. Like nothing. So this is just pure like will right now. Reveal the path you must reach. Come on, mate. Let's see what you got. Is that it? That's pathetic. Wow, bro. You're an embarrassment. All right, I'll give you one more chance. That's all you've got? I'll give you one more chance. No, nah, I can't give you any more chances. Sorry, man. All right. As we head into the final boss. Now. Bang. Bang. The most nonchalant expert. I know what you mean, man. I'm sort of just like absolutely dominating these guys without worrying. You'll get there, man. Don't you worry. You'll be there soon. You'll be better than me. I'm really just going to... I'm really just going to end this boss quickly, guys. I've never used the staff before. By the way, it's not really working. I sort of want to, yeah, just get rid of it. As I said, this is going to be boring. I'm literally just going to do this heavy attack over and over. Because I don't know if anything has more power, uh, more, is quicker than this. Like has more, um, oh, see, you know, you're supposed to do, a, I think you should do a different combo at the end there when you can punish him. But other than that, I think it's the best, best one to use. How satisfying is that? The dodging. See these camera angles, they get a little bit wonky. Oh, he got me there. What? That was weird. Try harder. You've barely even touched me, bro. I think it is the best counter-attack, true dad, yeah. Throw it to get a free combo, yeah, that's a good way. How many times have you played see-through, Dream Ah, uh, oh, I don't know, I've, I've versed every boss like 20 times at this point. In terms of playthrough, four, five, maybe six times. See, you can't use the focus here for anyone saying, why the fuck are you using focus? Well, you can't use it here. See, I find the triangle triangle combo is the best here. Watch the damage. And you get that last hit on the structure. I just find it to be the best. 
I just dodged that. Did anyone see that? I literally went up. Anyway. And he does it again. Wow. And again. <laughs> You'd think I'd learn. Oh, man. That low. It's deceiving, I tell ya. damage I'm putting out there. See that? And he keep, if you do a different... He won't always do those moves if you do a different one. If you do the square square, he won't follow up with that sometimes as well. That's why I find that that's the way to go. Alright, i got to get some structure going here. Alright, that's enough. Oh, I'm dead. That's the most deadly move in the entire fight. That one. That'll get that'll get you. I don't have time to get into reps, lol, but appreciate the encouragement. Congrats on the sick play through 100% of the game. Tenth of the time. <laughs> Let's take. Thank you, man. I appreciate it. Thanks for stopping by. PC of PC mod of Yang, all the abilities in the beginning would be a nice new game plus. Great idea, man. There's a lot they can do. Oh, I've never seen that low he does just then. Never seen that before. Come on, mate. You're so close to breaking. Alright, and don't attack him there. Don't attack him. You shouldn't have done that. Oh, okay, mate. All right, we're about to spare the final boss, and that is going to be it. Your reliance on your gift will be your downfall. downfall. The reliance on your gift will be your downfall. What's your downfall, man? That I'm too good for you? And that is it, guys. Round of applause. 100% in 3 hours and 18. The board is done. Two endings as well. Not bad. Stay with me. Not bad at all. Finally beat Yang as the 22-year-old. Thank you. Well done, man. Great job. It's not over. I forgot. Fuck. Shit. Oh, fuck. I forgot there's a third phase. I completely forgot. That's hilarious. It's pretty sick that there's a third phase and you can't die. I would have cracked it if you, if you could die here. Oh, I've actually got to parry him here, don't I? How do you beat him? I forgot. There's a f there's a way to do it here. Oh god. You gotta keep his structure going. I got him here. I got him. We got him. Nearly dead. Nearly dead. Nearly dead. Come on. And you can't spare him here, by the way, if guys are going to ask. Oh my god, the angles. This is terrible angles. They need, need to open this one up a little bit. Because it's very claustrophobic, that fight. Yang and his brother are so similar. I know, they look identical. So in order to get the true ending, you have to be 20 years old, right? Not at all. Not at all. This is the true ending, what you're seeing right here. By sparing every boss fight and then sparing him at the end, you will get that true good ending. Where it sort of alludes he's alive. Well, it alludes he's alive. And... Um, and you never know, it could be a second game. 
CRC4 Liam. How are you? You've come at an interesting time. We've just finished nearly. I love this little this section here. When I first found it, because I was actually one of the first people to um, to find this out. Hence, you know, the first PS4 plat. Beautiful surroundings. The music. Beautiful sun. Beautiful. Gotta love it. And now he's at peace. He didn't kill any of the bosses. He didn't technically get that revenge. But, um, yeah, just phenomenally done game, isn't it? Beautiful stuff. And then you get this secret ending here. Ready? There he is. There he is, baby. He's alive. He's alive, man. I just watched the video where you're talking to Rob Weedoff. Huh? <laughs> Thanks. That's that's good. He's a great guy. No, thank you guys. That's it. That is one hundred percent on Sifu. The detective board is done. Let's just look at it one more time. And if any of you guys are stuck with any of these, now you have a guide to find them all. Go back through this video if you're missing one and you'll know exactly what to do. There it is there. You can find out a bit of the lore about these villains. She had a twin, hence the two sides to that boss fight. Um, she was one of the most popular, so powerful women in the world. Hence the tower. This guy was a drug dealer uh, that um, had some way over, you know, his way with the plants. Sean, Sean's father was an asshole, was he? I think so. He was involved in an event called the Burning. Interesting. And then there's Yang. Oh. He was raised by my father, Sifu. We knew that. We were close. He taught me a lot over the years. He disappeared with his wife and daughter when I was still a child. He came back years later and murdered my father in cold blood. He now lives above the city and runs a traditional healing center, but he doesn't appear to be in touch with the world. Interesting. Very interesting. You can look at this all, guys. Guys, I'm going to end it there, get some sleep, but I hope you uh, enjoyed, appreciated that run-through. If you could, leave a like, subscribe, become a member, all that good stuff, and uh, plenty more Sifu videos to come. You're probably thinking, what have you got left? I've got a few little bits and pieces left for you guys. And then we're heading into Horizon Forbidden West, and we're heading into... Um, we're heading into Elden Ring so that's going to be a lot of fun guys thanks guys I will see you later take care guys